had his dress last week. No. I don't think so. Just so pretty on the road. No, I mean. <laughs> okay. Nobody cares. I know. Well, if all the women would have decided to come out on the road. And I got your uh, voicemail okay. yesterday. Uh, I just, I'm in Slam, so I have No problem. But I'll get up with you. Uh, Mike, check uh, one, two, three, four, five. This is five. a Sony A6000. No event. Uh, it's like, hmm? well, it's oh, okay. Right. Okay. Yeah, it's actually yeah. auto follow for <laughs> his. Well, we have a link. Do their links detach? Or yep. Uh, although I think they're. Yeah, look at this, guys. Pretty... What do you think of this? Like I like it. I need a picture. Um, so um, someone asked the following that we dress um, up as Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, or that we flip flop each like other. Can I have a jacket? Yeah. Do you record in 4K at all for any of your shows? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
first of all. Well, sure. they said they said we'll do it. We'll do a Twitter account and then release the memes through the Twitter account. Like also, that. it'll be I'll the jacket, the jacket Twitter account. So with the memes about the T-shirt. Hey, Zach's fans, what do you think about that? How we put a whole Twitter account around the jacket? What do you think of that? It's just a, just the jacket. And then the t-shirt eventually, that can come later. <laughs> I think we're ready. The mic is okay? Oh, I didn't know about that. Is Cheryl's mic still going in and out? <coughs> what is this of you? Oh, how was your, um, did you go to see Cameron? I can get it closer. The connection to the mic uh, is just like, either we have it or we don't. To, so uh, I'll let you know if we have to do it again. Right, okay. I re I Putting you closer. Which is nice. What, what? Putting it. Put it close. Oh, you got hearts. Lots of hearts. Oh, that's so lots of I'm hearts. I'm not sure for who. The jacket. It's oh, it's the, the jacket. jacket. What do you have to say about the jacket? <laughs> <laughs> you can, can you respond, Bobby? Are you focused? I mean, well, you can't respond. Like, you have to write back or whatever. Um, oh, can you write back? You can't. You have to say Yeah, you just have to say it. Thank you for the hearts. Who are the hearts for? <laughs> yeah. A couple the more. The jacket. <laughs> Well, they, they, can't they? Yeah. Don't we get to see what they write? If yeah, they write but something? only if they write something. Oh, if they write it. So the hearts are just, you don't know who the heart. Oh, there. Zach. <laughs> Zach. It's for Zach. Oh, it's NFC. Oh, Ryan, what's up, Ryan? Yeah, it's Ryan. gentlemen. <laughs> is your mom on Twitter? <laughs> I doubt. Uh, my mom is not she's on, on Facebook. <laughs> no, she's on Facebook. We should introduce a... um. A periscope from this into the show. It's like you know how you do like the pan of that. Oh, you just as one of the yeah. one of the cameras. Yeah, you're right. Not necessarily the camera, but like shoot the camera and then go off of it. Wait, Ted, we could we could use that? the. So you know how like sometimes he starts with yeah, the text. Yeah, I really like that. Instead of just doing <gasps> that, do that idea. and then it over. and then pan from there to there. So create uh, start out on the. the action. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, okay. the actual camera. Like start there. What do you see? But even you see us, right? <laughs> are, we re are they ready? What was it you said, Bobby, yesterday? You're like, I like to take pictures and people take you pictures. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, I do. That's my <laughs> and you could tell they were like, what? The best is when people yeah, take pictures that. with iPads. That's the, yeah, right. That's like the... iPad picture selfies, or they're like, oh. Yeah, and then take a picture of that. <laughs> right, Kobe, that's what you do, right? And someone take a picture of that. Taking... You did that yesterday, didn't you, Kobe? <laughs> yeah. Are you guys ready? <coughs> you know, I can, um, do you want me to put the mic on the floor? Or are we okay right now? No, I think we're okay right okay, now. So I think it's just going to be one of those touch and go things. All right, I, are you good rolling or? I'm rolling. I'm rolling. Okay, we are good. Okay, in three, two. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Cheryl Tan. And I'm Zach Miller. Welcome to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Over the next few shows, we'll be focusing on the importance of networking. Nothing highlights the importance of networking more than the shops along Botetourt Street in Norfolk. On June 8th of this year, the building holding Cure Coffee House, Hummingbird Macarons, and Voila International Cuisine, among others, partially collapsed. The damage caused the businesses to be displaced for weeks. I spoke with the owners of Hummingbird and Voila about how their connections to the community helped them through some pretty rough times. That was really, really good, except they lost your mic. That okay, I'm gonna good. just take it off. Okay. Hole, I'm just gonna put it on the ground. Is that okay? Um, one, two, one, two, testing, one, two, three, thank you. Okay. Is that better? Okay. Because yeah. you can't see this, right? No. Uh, you, you might have. Can you see that wire a little? Uh, maybe I'll just move it. Zoom in a little. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. That stinks. <laughs> All right. Okay. In three, two. Hello, and thanks for joining us. I'm Cheryl Tan. And I'm Zach Miller. Welcome to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Over the next few shows, we'll be focusing on the importance of networking. Nothing highlights the importance of networking more than the shops along Botetourt Street. On June 8th of this year, the building holding Cure Coffee House, Hummingbird Macarons, and Voila International Cuisine, among others, partially collapsed. 
The damage caused the businesses to be displaced for weeks. I spoke with the owners of Hummingbird and Voila about how their connections to the community helped them through some pretty tough times. Okay. Um, I loved it. Do you, do you want me to maybe move it up a little bit or? It was good, now it's... Now it's you? Oh. No, you're a wire pen. I was shooting wider so he could do little pushes or pulls, but whatever. There we go. We should be good. You gotta get a mic check, Zach. Mic check, one, two, three. And I'm Zach Miller. Welcome to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. I'm okay. Saying, you know, if you shoot slightly wider, you can do like a little push or pull. Uh, yeah, but then we see the mic cord <coughs> oh, come out of. Uh... Who cares? Yeah, we got a copy machine the last show. <laughs> All right. Can do it. Oh, that's great. <laughs> All right, we are rolling. In three, two. Hello, and thanks for joining us. I'm Cheryl Tan. And I'm Zach Miller. Welcome to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Over the next few shows, we'll be focusing on the importance of networking. Nothing highlights the importance of networking more than the shops along Botetourt Street. On June 8th of this year, the building holding Cure Coffee House, Hummingbird Macarons, and Voila International Cuisine, among others, partially collapsed. The damage caused the businesses to be displaced for weeks. I spoke with the owners of Hummingbird and Voila about how their connections to the community helped them through some pretty tough times. Excellent. All right, move on to the next piece. Can we scroll past this? We'll get the, uh, all the two shots done first. And then... Yep. Three. Are you ready, Bob? Yeah. You can go for it. Three, two. We're back with more Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Let's go back to the shops on Botetourt. I talked with Chris Shelton, co-owner of Cure Coffee House, about the importance of having good insurance. Cool. One more for safety. That's so true. Three, two. We're back with more Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Let's go back to the shops on Botetourt. I talked with Chris Shelton, co-owner of Cure Coffee House, about the importance of having good insurance. Nice. We can scroll forward. Um, dip and close. In three, two. That's all for this week's Hampton Roads Business Weekly. You can find the show on Facebook and Twitter at HR Business Weekly or at HRBusinessWeekly.com. For Hampton Roads Business Weekly, I'm Zach Miller. And I'm Cheryl Tan. We'll see you next week. And one more for safety. <clears throat> In three, two. That's all for this week's Hampton Roads Business Weekly. You can find the show on Facebook and Twitter at HR Business Weekly or at HRBusinessWeekly.com. For Hampton Roads Business Weekly, I'm Zach Miller. And I'm Cheryl Tan. We'll see you next week. Nice. And now can we scroll to lot two, I believe. Do you want me to move? Yeah, we'll knock out Zach's one shot. Okay. So, uh, we're taking two weeks off after this Sunday. Yes. And... So, are we taping next Thursday? Yeah, that's what I guess that's uh, We won't tape intros for next Thursday. So, two okay. weeks we off. Are, we're, we're, we're shooting with you on Thursday. Yep, Thursday morning. And we're sh still shooting your stuff on, on Wednesday? Wednesday. Yeah. Okay. And then remember, and I'll send you notes about what we talked about for the September in Hampton. Cool. Yeah. Yep. You think the ninth. Yeah. Can you guys um, scroll the prompter just so I can see which one this is? Is this the one where I... All right. It's definitely center. Let me just fix this it. real quick. Thank you. Your hair's looking good, Zach. Mm -hmm. I do it for the jacket. 
<laughs> the jacket told me to do it. So if, if you guys want to give a lot of hearts right now on Periscope, uh, you're about to be filmed for the show. And this will make it very hearty. Hearty. You guys ready? ready? Yep. Uh, I am rolling. All right, rolling. <coughs> Three, two. Welcome back to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Okay, you're ready to start your business, but one of the most important decisions you'll make is where to set up shop. I talked with Stephanie Senker of Nuzbaum Realty about the questions you need to ask. Mmm, so close. Almost. It's gonna have a good show. Three. Wait, hold on one second. Get All right. those hearts going. <laughs> tap, 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 tap. Three. Kobe, you should do it. Three, two. Welcome back to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Okay, you're ready to start your business. One of the most important decisions you'll make is where to set up shop. I talked with Stephanie Sinker of Nuzbaum Realty about the questions you need to be asking when finding a space for your business. Nice. One more for safety. Three, two. Okay. Welcome back to Hampton Roads Business Weekly. Okay, you're ready to start your business. One of the most important decisions you'll make is where to set up shop. I talked with Stephanie Sinker of Nuzbaum Realty about the questions you need to be asking when finding a space for your business. Beautiful. By the way, that uh, location was ridiculous. That, uh, oh, I know. What location? That building. The floor that I'm built out. Oh the well, uh, Wells Fargo. I mean, I've been in that building before, and I've been on the top floor, mm -hmm. but this one, it was really nice. And it was not built out, so it was really cool. All right. Three, two. It's time for our Entrepreneur of the Week. Here we highlight a local business owner to learn what advice they have for other entrepreneurs. Today, we talk with the owner of O'Connor's Brewery, Kevin O'Connor. Oh, one more. Three, two. It's time for our Entrepreneur of the Week. Here we highlight a local business owner to learn what advice they have for other entrepreneurs. Today, we talk with the owner of O'Connor's Brewery, Kevin O'Connor. Cool. Um, yep, there we go. Yep. Three, two, Naoma Dorguzi, our social marketing expert, is here with tips on how to save time with your social media. Three, two, Naoma Dorguzi, our social marketing expert, is here with tips on how to save time with your social media. Good. Woo! I think we did. We had. I don't think we had any one shots for Cheryl. Oh. Let me look at the script real quick. Scrum up. Yeah. Yeah. We pulled out the uh, <laughs> the discrepancy from last night. Where... Um, I think he's got it. Hmm? You understood. Oh yeah. What are you doing? There? I'm, we're gonna do our, our tech thing. We're gonna do our tech oh, thing. Oh, you're prepping it up. Yeah. Thank you for we're watching. See you soon. <laughs> yeah, that is it. We are good. Okay, we're good. can we stick around? We